In this video, we are going to focus about factor theorem. To solve polynomial equations, katulad nito. So, ano nga ba itong factor, factor theorem? Basically, when f of c is equals to 0, then x minus c is a factor of the polynomials. And we will write it as f of x. Bali, itong x minus c is a factor of f of x. Ngayon, i-reverse natin. If x minus c is a factor, then f of c is equals to 0. Ngayon, para mas lalong maintindihan yan, sagutan na natin itong number 5 and number 6. Ang gagawin natin yung trial and error sa mga choices. So, this is, ang unahin natin yung letter A, x minus 1. Lahat ng mga choices, equate natin to 0. So, x minus 1 is equals to 0. Para maging 0 yan, so ang value ni x ay positive 1. So, this is 1 equals 2x cubed. So, ang x natin ay 1 minus, yung x again ay 1. Then, minus 21 multiplied sa x, which is equals to 1, plus 18. Now, this is equals to, by the way, to i cubed. Since 1 lang naman yan, so this is equals to 2 minus 1 minus 21 plus 18. By following order of operations, we have to solve this from left to right. 2 minus 1 minus 21 plus 18 and that is negative 2. So hindi siya equals to 0. So hindi siya ang factor dito. So eliminate na natin si a. Next, erase natin ito at doon na tayo sa letter B. Ang letter B, equate ulit natin sa 0. So, ang x is equals to 2. So, lagyan natin ng 2 ang lahat ng x. 2 cubes is equals to 8. I-multiply natin sa 2 and that is equals to 16. Minus 2 times 2 is equals to 4. 21 times 2 is equals to 42 plus 18. Again, by following order of operations, we will solve them, this from left to right. 16 minus 4 is equals to 12. Minus 42, that is equals to negative 30. Negative 30 plus 18, and that is negative 12. Hindi pa rin siya equal to 0, so hindi yan ang factor. So, next na, na tayo, dito na tayo sa letter C. Ang letter C, x minus 3. So, equate ulit natin sa 0. So, x is equals to positive 3. So, 3 times 3 times 3, that is 27. I-multiply natin ng 2, that is 54. Next, 3 times 3 equals 9. Then, 21 times 3, and that is 63 plus 18. Again, by following order of operation, we will solve this from left to right. Kasi addition at subtraction lang andito. 54 minus 9 minus 63 plus 18. And that is exactly 0. Ulitin natin, 54 minus 9, that is 45. 45 minus 63, that is negative 18. And negative 18 plus 18, that is 0. So therefore, ang sagot dito ay letter C. Which of the following is a factor of 2x cubed minus x squared minus 21x plus 18? x minus 3. 
let's double check this by using synthetic method. So, x minus 3 daw, tapos equate natin ng 0. So, x is equals to positive 3. I-bring down natin itong mga coefficient dito. This is 2, 1, negative 1 pala to, negative 21, 18. Ang leading coefficient, i-bring down natin. 2 times 3 is equals to 6. Negative 1 plus 6 is equals to 5. 5 times 3 is equals to 15. Negative 21 plus 15 is equals to negative 6. Negative 6 times 3 is equals to negative 18. 18 plus negative 18 is equals to 0. So, therefore, tama itong letter C natin. Next, dito na tayo sa number 6. Which of the following is a factor of x, 6x cubed plus 5x squared minus 2x minus 1? Again, kopyahin muna natin ito. So, we have f of x is equals to 6x cubed plus 5x squared minus 2x minus 1. I-substitute ulit natin. Sa letter A, x minus 1 equate natin to 0. So, ang x natin dyan ay 1. So, lahat ng x ay lagyan natin ng 1. So, this is 1. And this one is 1. 1 din yan. Then, since 1 lang naman yan, so, kopyahin lang natin yan siya. This is 2 minus 1. 6 plus 5 is equals to 11. Minus 2 is equals to 9. Minus 1 is equals to 8. Hindi siya equals to 0. So, mali si letter A. Eliminate na natin yan. Next, do na tayo sa letter B. Erase muna natin ito. Pero bago ang lahat, again, equate natin yung B na yan to 0. So, 2x minus 1 is equals to 0. 2x is equals to 1. Kasi tinatransfer na natin yan, ang negative 1 maging positive 1 or plus 1. Then, para ma-isolate si x dyan, so itong si 2 since pang multiply, pang divide na siya sa 1. So, x is equals to 1 half or 0.5. Now, Dito sa number or letter B, our x is equals to 0.5. So, this is 0 0.5, 0 0.5, at ito ay multiply natin ng 0 0.5. Isolve na natin to, hoping na mag-equal to 0 para yun na yung sagot. 0 0.5 times 0 0.5 times 0 0.5 kasi exponent of 3, and that is 0 0.125. Multiplied natin sa 6 and that is equals to 0.75 plus exponent ulit 0 0.5 times 0 0.5 and that is equals to 0 0.25. 0 0.25 times 5 and this is equals to 100, ni pala 1.25. Then 2 times 0 0.5 and that is equals to 1. At kopyahin yung isa pang 1. 0 0.75 plus 1.25, that is equals to 2. 2 minus 1 minus 1, that is equals to 0. So, therefore, letter B ang tamang sagot dito. Ito yung factor dito sa 6x cubed plus 5x squared minus 2x minus 1. Ang factor dito ay 2x minus 1 kasi na-equate siya sa 0. Mas maganda i-double check natin using yung synthetic division. Dapat yung last natin ay magiging 0 katulad dito sa number 5. So, doon tayo sa factor dito which is yung letter B 2x minus 1 equate ulit natin sa 0. So, that is 
2x is equals to 1, then x is equals to 1 half or 0.5. Itong 0.5 na ito, yan yung gamitin natin pang multiply sa mga numbers dito. Yung 6, 5, negative 2, negative 1. I-bring down lang yung pinakaunang coefficient natin na 6. 6 times 0.5 and that is 3. 5 plus 3 is equals to 8. 8 times 0.5 that is equals to 4. Negative 2 plus 4 is equals to 2. 2 times 0.5 is equals to 1. Negative 1 plus 1 is equals to 0. So therefore, tama itong letter B na sagot natin, 2x minus 1. Thank you for watching. All I hope na mayroon kayong natutunan sa video ito. Thank you.